gentlemen welcome to today's very quick toy preview and today's main character is the green leaf studio tifa lock heart and this is the latest picture of the chinese buyers and some of them actually shared the pictures in our groups our wechat groups so before we start those who are under 18 years old please do not watch this video what? because there are some pictures which is not really suitable for underage kids mm -hmm. okay without further ado let's check out the pictures okay first let's see the 3d rendering pictures provided by the greenleaf studio when they are taking the pre-orders okay looks not bad i have to say that the greenleaf studio tifa don't really look like tifa but it's a decent look uh, not bad quite pretty look okay and then i don't have the prototype pictures but i remember the prototype pictures is actually not bad quite similar to the 3d rendering and now let's see the box the brown box over here okay and when they open up the box just like their promotion pictures about the final products and the box art uh, pretty good too and the box is not that huge so for those who are overseas outside China the shipping fee might not be really expensive and these are the accessories I think it's for the belt and you can see that the top is actually removable it's a soft fabric not like the other Tifa like the O2 Tifa that I reviewed it's actually a, a piece of resins not cloth not fabric material okay and let's see the head hmm not considered pretty not considered accurate to Tifa but this is actually looks quite same as the prototypes the final products pictures the second picture looks pretty good too especially the eyes I like to say that Greenleaf Studio actually uh, quite good with their female characters okay the one that I like the most is the Android 18 and Claire is okay Ada Wong really really a lot of people like it and the recast is already out if you if you saw it on my page I've shared it this is another picture of the, the inside the box you see the body is fully naked and it's in one piece so you won't see a seam line when you're connecting each parts together which I think is very good sound like a PPS <laughs> I'm so sorry because I think the PPS is really I don't really like to bash him but I bash them based on the products because the final product is totally so different from their prototypes even their final product pictures is different from the product that we receive in our hand so no offense to PPS I'm just commenting based on facts okay let's get ready for the new picture yeah sorry I have to <laughs> I have to cover it because even in my Facebook I actually get warned by Facebook they said that I against their community guideline which I think is totally nothing because I didn't show nipples I just show uh, some very sexy toys but Facebook is too too many restrictions that my page is gonna get banned anytime like my first page actually get banned because of stupid reasons this so far is good what I mean good again is it is actually the same like the prototype pictures that they provided unlike PPS what? okay show this one the close-up one you see <laughs> if your house got kids this is not really good but if your house don't have kids this is really good because you can see that the nipple actually visible on top of the fabric and it's really nice it's really nice the fabric is so soft actually you can see the skin color another picture this one is with the flashlight on I think it's really decent not look like Tifa but it's good looking at least the face is normal not like the others <laughs> and yes that's all 
This is a real first hand pictures that I got just now less than 30 minutes ago. And for those who got it, I think uh, congratulations to you because unlike other Tifa, it's like gambling. It's totally like gambling because we place our deposit based on the promotional pictures, the prototype pictures, but when the final product came out, we can't, we can't refund our deposit. We just have to pay full and get the product that we don't like. But for GLS, they don't sponsor me anything, okay? But I have to say that their product is really good. Except for the Jew. The upcoming Jew, I think the face is short of something. I don't know what to say. But for the Jew, uh, we are talking about the remake version. For Jew Valentine, I think the FE Studio is doing quite, quite a good job. If you wanted to buy, you can consider FE Studios. But for Greenleaf Studio, I think the Jew is um, a bit different, okay? Not the one that I expect, not the one that I like. Alright, that's a very short video today. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe and give me a like. And feel free to leave your comments below at this comment section. And I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.